we gotta do the basic video because of the season, you know? There you go. I guess this time is inevitable. And I guess it's time for all those back to school season videos. Yeah. So, it's not gonna be the most exciting, but that's okay. So, uh, I'm gonna start with what I already have or what I've already opened. I did, oh, pfft, I completely forgot my intro. <laughs> Hi guys, well, welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. Um, today's video is going to be a back to school haul, I guess. Um, I did my back to school shopping kind of early, but that's always good because I hate crowds and I hate like how messy it gets the closer it gets to um, the actual start of school. But uh, yeah, this video is going to be quick and easy. So enjoy. <laughs> Some of the stuff that I have... Um, is already opened because I took a summer class so I needed to um, you know open the stuff to use the stuff for the summer class I'm gonna start big and then build my way up till we get to like I guess the biggest product which is the backpack this is the pencil case I love these pencil cases because you can fold them down and then it's like a little pencil holder and I just have pencils and then a couple uh, other stuff like like uh, tabs and stuff like that. I have this opened pack of pencils. The Bic Extra Strong Break Resistant Lead Pencils. Mechanical Pencils. And I have another pack of pencils from Bic, which is the Extra Smooth Darker Writing. And this is a uh, 0.7. I love these. These are like the best mechanical pencils. Honestly, Bic pencils are like the best pencils, um, mechanical pencils wise. But um, I like the cheap paper mate ones are so trash like i'll put in a picture somewhere but the those ones they're so bad they're so just awful no mm -mm. next i have a pack of my favorite pens these are the paper mate ink joy gel 0 0.7 uh point pens these are my favorite because they they just write so nicely and they're so smooth and I actually prefer the like the cap ones rather than the clicked ones and um, they're just so great for taking notes and being organized and making sure you're writing everything down properly so they're just they're so perfect next I have some of the best highlighters sharpie highlighters don't Mm -mm. sharpie highlighters they look the best they work the best like they're not super cheap but so um oh shit i don't know what all those faces were but you can just ignore that like just move right along don't say anything mm -mm, don't mention it mm -mm. skip these are the best highlighters. And then I also got a pack of glue and Elmer's glue. Once again, the best glue. Moving on to like notebooks and paper and stuff. I have a pack of college ruled paper. The non-reinforced ones. Because the reinforced ones make it harder for you to like write notes. Like Cornell notes. And um, I got one pack because I have some paper in my garage. And I got three folders one of these i actually got last year but three folders so we have a black one that's smooth and then we also have a black one that's like textured it has this um like uh like diamond print or like no yeah it has like a diamond print on it and then i got a blue one that has a diamond print on it but I love these folders. They're just amazing. I especially love the little like paper hold thing right here. And they're just super durable. I still have my folder from last year. And they're just so good. I used to be the type of person who would buy these. And I only have these because um, I think my friend's mom gave them to me. But these, 
I I used to like these honestly, but the sheets are just so much smaller because they're um I think eight by ten, something like that. So I think these are like eight by ten, which I mean I think the normal paper size is an 8x10 so if I get an actual like worksheet from a teacher then I would have to trim it and cut it to fit this notebook which just takes more time and it's inconvenient plus because it's like a cardboard cover they rip really easily so you know I leveled up and I got <laughs> I now get five star notebooks because yeah they're more expensive but if it makes it so that my notebook isn't falling apart by the end of the year then that's so much better I got one in white this is just a one subject college ruled I have one in black once again one subject I have one in purple and then I have a five subject notebook in yellow. Um, I would have preferred like white or black, but uh, they didn't have it in the five subject. So I chose yellow because I don't know, I like yellow. And um, I got a five subject and this could probably actually be used for two classes. I'm having six classes this year that will most likely require a notebook or like a journal of some sort plus I'm taking AP Spanish language for my sophomore year which is the year that's coming up and uh, for my freshman year I took Spanish 1 the teacher who teaches Spanish 1 is the same one that teaches AP Spanish language and I already know from being in that Spanish 1 class that she gives you like so much work to do in your notebook. And I had bought a one subject notebook last year and probably halfway through the second semester I was like out of paper. Like I had to staple so many things in my notebook like so many extra sheets so that I could actually keep up. And like I don't want to do that again. So this is a uh, 200 sheet well, she's a thick notebook. She's she's thick. Yeah, let's move on. I see in most back to school halls, like they got like gum and hand sanitizer, like stuff like that. But I kind of already have all that stuff, so I didn't really need to buy it. Like I have hand hand sanitizer. Um, I need to buy gum though, like a lot of gum, and then I'm not gonna share it with anybody throughout the whole year. For the big thing, okay. So this is the last thing I got. This is uh, my backpack for this year. It's um, it's like this pretty pink Adidas logo and then the three stripes and it's just all black. Um, there's a pocket up here that's like uh, velvety almost for like electronics and stuff like that. So that's going to be really good for headphones and my phone and all that. And then inside... There's a pocket in the back for, it says for a laptop, but I'm not using it for a laptop. I usually get laptop carrying bags because they have the extra pocket. So, um, yeah, but I just organize and put papers back here, like, um, like separate pieces of paper back here. And I just, it's way easier to keep it organized. And then I, I also like this backpack because it's not like one of those normal like zip around. It's just like a flap. <laughs> so it'll probably be easier to find my stuff. And the space is pretty big in here. And then there's another inside pocket that you can't see. It's like a net one. So once again, good for pencils and pens and um, like other school supplies. And then the last pocket, oh, and it has cup holders too, like little water bottle holders on the side. And then the front pocket, it's just a normal one front pocket, but I really like that. I actually got that at Ross. I mean, I'm not ashamed. I got that at Ross for like 30 bucks instead of like 60 bucks. So, um, you know, and they had Jansport backpacks there too. But, um, you know, you don't always have to go to a normal store, I guess. Like uh, Journeys or Zoomies or even Target. Like Target sells Jansport, I think. Yeah. Yeah, they do. Um, or even buy it online. Like, like you can go to Ross, you can go to Marshalls, you can go to TJ Maxx, and you can find just as good of a backpack there for like half the price. So... 
yeah now that i'm done with my little mini rant i hope you guys enjoyed please like comment and subscribe down below tell me what thing like you liked the most like did you like the backpack did you like the this big ass yellow notebook like what'd you like and then um yeah i said subscribe already but I want to like tell you why you should subscribe because I definitely think that those upcoming videos are going to be so interesting so you should watch out for those and um you know if you want turn on post notifications that's cool too <laughs> anyways I love you guys so much and I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next video bye